638 here on your Thursday. If you ever wondered how bees make honey, you can learn more about it through a free beginner beekeeping course that's coming to Clemens. All right, Star Connor joins us now this morning. Star, tell us why it's so important to get more people involved in beekeeping. Well, local beekeeper Ali Musavi says that more than 35% of our food depends on pollinators, especially the honeybees. You see the honey here, they already consumed this honey. That's the up close education you will experience from a master beekeeper, Ali Musaviv. We educate the public and uh, in the class that uh, the biology of honeybees. He's giving 30 people a free five week course, teaching them how to protect the future of honeybees. They get familiar of uh, how honeybees see, what color they don't see, and what what kind of flowers they love. Musa Aviv explains the lifetime of a working honeybee is four to six weeks. The queen lives much longer. The honeybees inside of these boxes are Italian bees. Musa Aviv tells me that there aren't many honeybees as there used to be. Several factors include a shortage of flowers. Even the person doesn't know anything about honeybee, they can help them by planting flowers in their garden or uh, in their yard, specific flowers that the honeybee lacks it and is a kind of protein for them. They need to plant flowers for the fall. The problem comes when they are short with the flower and nectar during the fall because everything disappears. Musa V says there's another challenge that every beekeeper in the U.S. is facing. Parasite named Veroa mites. Musa Aviv says although you can't protect honeybees from these parasites, you can plant more flowers to help the honeybees population. And those flowers that you can plant include goldenrods, dandelions, and purple asters. The Bee Academy course starts this Saturday at the Animal Ark Vet Hospital in Clemens, and there's still slots available. In the studio, I'm Star Connor. Awesome.